you see, got a swollen lymph node there. Yeah, it must be pretty painful. Mm-hmm. Okay, we'll definitely have a check for that, okay? Okay. All right, let's go ahead and get you checked in, and then we'll go ahead and start with the examination. Do you have any um, questions so far before I get you all checked in? Okay. You're kind of worried it might be a tooth. Okay. Why did you not go to the dentist? Just in case it was something else. For sure. Okay. No problem. All right. Well, why don't you go ahead and give me your first and last name? Thank you. And then your uh, birth date. Okay. Perfect. And is this um, address and phone number still good for you? Okay. All right. Perfect. Um, and then when did you see this starting for your lymph node getting all swollen? Okay. So, a couple days ago, then it just kind of got unbearable. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. It is quite painful. Okay. Now, do you have like a difficulty time swallowing or like extra saliva in your mouth? Both? Okay. So, I'm gonna say it's, um, Pretty painful. How was eating? Is eating pretty difficult? Okay. No problem. I'll look in your mouth just a little bit, but we might need to go and get um, you an appointment at the dentist because we might need to have one of your teeth extracted. We might need to take an x-ray for that. Okay? Alright, well we'll go ahead and check your lymph node. I'll also um, look at your other lymph notes as well. We'll also um, take a small blood sample just in case we just want to rule out everything. Okay, perfect. Okay. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and take your vitals real quick unless you have any other questions. Okay. You just want the drugs. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> okay. So, are you comfortable sitting there? Okay, sounds good. I'll go ahead and take your vitals real quick. Um, I want to check your heart maybe a little bit more because if you have an infection, especially if it's this severe, you might have a slightly elevated heart rate. Um, that's another reason we're going to take, uh, take blood today just in case. Just don't want anything to be spreading. Okay, sounds good. Okay, now just try to relax for me. And just take a couple deep breaths. Thank you. Yeah, just in and out. It does sound a little bit quick, but that could be just because you're at the doctor's office. Okay. Now I'm going to check your lungs just a little bit. Could you uh, just take a couple deep breaths for me? Perfect. Good. And another one. Good. And try the other side here.
Okay, now I also want to check your blood pressure real quick. Um, I'm gonna just uh, use your arm right here and then we're just gonna see if anything's off about it, okay? Okay, so I'm going to put this around your arm. Is this one okay for you? Okay. Perfect. Alright. Alright, now just take a couple deep breaths and it'll kind of tighten around. Blood pressure is a little bit high. Don't need to know that. Okay. real quick, okay? See if there's any extra redness. And then I also want to look in your ears because since that lymph node is really close to your ear canal, I just want to make sure there's nothing going on in there too, okay? Okay, so just look straight at me. Perfect. I'll just look on the side just a little bit. look pretty good. Okay. So, I'm gonna put my gloves on for your ears. So I have to get a little bit closer for that, okay? Alright, and I'm just gonna take my little tool and then look in your ear real quick, alright? Alright, here we go. any of that hurt or anything like that? No? Okay. I don't see any redness. It looks like you take really good care of your ears. so very clean as well. So good job. <laughs> okay, so we're going to look at this one too. Looks pretty good. Okay. Ears look really nice, eyes look really good. So it is kind of worrying me that it is probably in either your mouth or could be something worse, but let's not um, worry about that just yet, okay? Okay. So now I want to look in your mouth real quick. I'm going to use my light and my little uh, suppressor tool here and then see if we can find it. Alright, so if you could just open your mouth. Does that hurt just opening your mouth too? Okay, just, just a tiny bit. Okay, alright, so that's okay. Alright, so just gonna look here. see some swelling on your back teeth here. Let me look on this side. Okay. I can't, um, I'm not gonna diagnose it just in case, but it could be a pericordinitis where it means that the gum is um, inflamed and swollen, could be infected as well. That's what it's looking like. So, I think probably the best bet is to have a dentist check this out for you, okay? Okay, so we'll definitely get that checked out. I still want to go and take some blood work just in case, because I just, you never know. So, let me get one more little look in here, okay? Um, yeah, I'm sorry about that. I know this is extremely painful. And could you lift up your tongue? Perfect. Okay. 
actually the bottom of your tongue looks pretty good. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So throw that away. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and start just kind of feeling on your lymph node a little bit. I also wanna check you have a lot of lymph nodes like around um, under your arm as well. So I'm gonna kinda check there to see if there's anything else that um, could be um, swollen to. Okay? Okay. Alright, so let me know if this is painful at any time. Probably will be because I can I can already see that this one on that side is actually pretty enlarged. So I'll be as gentle as I can, okay? You said this started a couple a couple days ago, or when it started actually getting really bad. Okay. Were you taking any um, ibuprofen or acetaminophen or anything like that to help with the pain? Okay. And do you brush your teeth? I feel like twice, once, twice a day. other side, on this side, doesn't look like it's too bad. It's just a little inflamed compared to this one, so that definitely makes me think that it definitely is um, that in your mouth there. So, um, which is unfortunate. I mean, since the dentist will probably say that you will need to have that tooth extracted or at least uh, put you on some antibiotics, but I'll be able to give those to you today just to help Okay. All right, so I'm just gonna keep feeling around here just a little bit. Okay. Oops. Is that too painful? I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, so I'll just be a little more gentle here. Okay. All right. Hmm. Notes on that. Okay, so lymph node on your left side is extremely swollen. Okay, so you don't need to remove your clothing. I can feel around. It just looks like you have a thin enough shirt. I'm just gonna kind of feel um, kind of around your arm right here. Can you see right there? Right there. Um, yeah, you have a lot of lymph nodes um, on that part of your body. So I'm just gonna kind of feel to see if any are um, inflamed. Okay. So the next thing I'm 
I'm gonna do, I'm just going to take a little bit of blood so we can run that and then we'll be able to see if there's anything further that we need to take care of you for, okay? All right, do, do you prefer this arm or that arm or anything like that? This arm? Okay, all right. All right, yeah, if you could just roll up your sleeve, thank you. gentle little needle, okay? It's gonna go back into this little tube and then we'll just take this to back to the um, laboratory and process that for you. Okay. Okay. Alright. So, there is just gonna be a slight pinch. I'm gonna try my best to be as gentle as I can. But I'm using a really tiny little needle here, okay? So you shouldn't feel much, alright? Okay, so if you want, you can look to your side and then I'll just get on my way with that, okay? Alright. You're gonna be fine. Just fine. Good. for me. Okay. Yeah, no, I definitely think uh, we should definitely schedule you for a um, dental checkup. I could definitely see some inflammation. It's probably what it is. Um, I'm gonna still prescribe you some antibiotics just to help with the pain. And uh, the pain should honestly subside within about a day or two. So, I would still suggest you have it taken, taken, taken a look at, um, because you never know, it could come back, it could be inf um, infecting more of your nerves or anything like that. So, um, I'll go ahead and have the receptionist up front schedule that for you, unless you have somebody else in mind, um, that you can schedule that for, you can let her know, um, but in the meantime, yeah, I'll get you a prescription for some antibiotics, and yeah, that will have you sent on your way. Okay. Okay. So you'll just need to take this just twice a day, okay? Okay, perfect. And are you allergic to any medication? We looked over your lymph nodes, um, everything else looked good. Heart rate didn't seem to be um, too elevated, just maybe a little bit, because probably with everything happening. So, um, you, otherwise you should be fine. I'm pretty sure that it is your tooth, so we should get you um, to see a dentist as soon as possible, okay? Okay, awesome. Alright, well, you can go get that prescription. Um, at your local pharmacy, the receptionist will be able to help you with that, and she'll also be able to schedule that dentist for you if you like, or you can do that on your own, okay? Okay, all right, well, it was nice coming in. I'm sorry that you're in so much pain. I hope the um, medicine helps. Um, but otherwise, yeah, I hope the dentist will help 
help you out and be able to get that taken care of for you even more. Okay, all right, awesome. And then also in about um, a couple of days, you'll hear back from your blood results. Great, all right, well, you have a wonderful day. Thank you for coming in. <laughs> Bye.